Hey cat lovers and welcome back to another video. White cats are known to be some of the most beautiful felines in the world with their snowy white coats. But there's more to these cats than their looks. It turns out that white cats are interesting for a variety of reasons. As you'll soon learn, they have fascinating genetics and have also made impacts on the world. If you enjoy this kind of content, consider subscribing to the channel for more cat videos. Now let's discuss 10 fun facts about white cats. Number 1. White cats are very rare. White cats are quite rare, making up only 5% of all cats. This makes them some of the rarest cats around. Despite this, however, white cats can come in all different shapes and sizes. Their fur is not breed specific, so you can find white cats in many different breeds. White cats can also have straight, curly, short, or long hair. Speaking of hair, white cats lack melanin, which is responsible for the development of color in their hair. The absence of melanin results in no color in the hair or white hair. The genetics of white cats are quite fascinating. The gene that makes cats have white hair is what is known as a masking gene. This means that your cat's other genetic makeup may indicate a different color than white, but the white gene will dominate and will be the color presented. Oftentimes, white kittens will have spots of another color on the top of their head. This spot will disappear with time, but it can show you what color your cat would have been without the white masking gene. Number 2. Many white cats are deaf. White cats have higher rates of deafness than any other coat color. Around 20% of all white cats are believed to be deaf. Around 40% of white cats with one blue eye and 60-80% to of white cats with two blue eyes are deaf. Deaf white cats are either born deaf or gradually lose their hearing over time. There is no cure for their deafness as it's not caused by any disease or outside sources. It's simply coded within their genetics. White cats are more likely to be deaf than non-white cats because of the genetics associated with both hearing, blue eye color, and white hair color. As mentioned in fact number one, white cats lack melanin. Melanin is developed by stem cells. The stem cells that would develop melanin are absent in white cats. Interestingly, the same stem cells that are absent also heavily contribute to the development of the inner ear. So, white hair, blue eyes, and deafness are correlated because they all are a result of an absent stem cell at birth. Just to be clear, white hair does not cause deafness, but it strongly correlates with deafness. Number 3. White Cats Helped Scientists The strong correlation between white cats and deafness was a medical and scientific mystery for quite some time. It's thought that people began to connect the two as long ago as 1868. Even the famed scientist known for his theory of evolution, Charles Darwin, was fascinated by white cats. He discovered that white cats are often born deaf or go deaf within a short period of time after birth. His discoveries and fascinations with deaf white cats fueled research for future generations. Deaf white cats have helped scientists learn more about deaf human beings because a cat's auditory system is generally similar to humans. Wardenburg syndrome is the human counterpart of the white fur deafness correlation in cats. People with this syndrome make up 5% of all deaf people. This has led many scientists to believe that the white deaf cat could serve as a model to study deafness in humans. The research will continue to be done on white deaf cats to help improve hearing loss and deafness in humans. Number 4. White cats are likely to be odd-eyed. White cats are likely to have a condition known as complete heterochromia, where one of their eyes is a completely different color than the other. This condition does not affect vision, but it can affect their hearing. As mentioned in fact number 3, cats with only one blue eye have around a 40% chance of being deaf. Fascinatingly, cats with only one blue eye are likely to only be deaf in the ear on the corresponding side. Cats with complete heterochromia are known as odd-eyed cats. A cat born with both blue eyes can develop complete heterochromia after birth. Slowly, one of the eyes will turn a completely different color while the other one remains blue. Number 5. White cats usually have blue eyes. Speaking of eye color, white cats are most likely to have blue eyes. As mentioned earlier, white hair and blue eyes are a result of a lack of melanin. When a cat is developing in the womb, it will have stem cells that travel to different parts of its body. Stem cells that migrate to the skin and eyes turn into what are known as melanocytes. These are cells that contain melanin. White cats with blue eyes have a lack of melanin, so their melanocytes either contain no melanin or very little amounts. This results in an absence of color, which appears as white fur and blue eyes. As mentioned, white fur and blue eyes commonly go together because they are both a result of low levels of melanin. Around 15-40% to 40 of white cats have blue eyes. 
However, white cats can have almost any eye color from green to gold to yellow. Number 6. Many cat breeds can be white. Since the genetics for white cats are not breed specific, you can find many different types of white cats. Some of the most common breeds in which white cats are found include the American Shorthair, European Shorthair, Turkish Angora, Persian, and Maine Coon. These are just some of the many examples. However, that doesn't mean a white cat will be easy to find. As mentioned in fact number one, white cats are the rarest of all coat colors. So you may have your work cut out for you if you're looking for a white cat. Number seven, white cats are sensitive to the sun. White cats should not be left out in the sun for too long. Because of the lack of melanin responsible for their white fur, white cats are much more sensitive to the sun than other cats. It's very easy for white cats to develop sun irritation or sunburn. This is not only painful for your white cat, but can also further its risk of developing skin cancer in the future. In fact, white cats are much more at risk for skin cancer than other cats. When it comes to avoiding serious health problems, prevention is always the key. With this in mind, it's essential to learn how to protect your white cat from the sun. Thankfully, there are many pet subscreens. The RSCPA recommends putting pet-friendly sunscreen on areas where the fur is thin or non-existent, such as the nose, belly, and ear tips. These are areas where most sun damage occurs. Note that pet hats should be avoided because most cats hate them. An animal should never be forced to wear something that makes them uncomfortable. At the end of the day, you need to do what is most comfortable and healthy for your cat. Number eight, white and albino cats are different. Though white cats and albino cats look the same at first glance, they are actually different. While white cats do not have much melanin, albino cats are unable to create any melanin at all. The gene responsible for melanin production, TYR, is either damaged or entirely absent in albino cats. This results in their eyes, hair, and skin having zero pigmentation. Albino cats often have a pinkish looking skin due to the blood vessels underneath their skin appearing. Their eyes are either extremely pale blue or a light shade of pink. In comparison, non-albino white cats can have any eye color. As discussed earlier, the gene that codes for white fur is dominant and masking. This means that it will cover up any other colors that may be in your cat's genetics. Albino cats, on the other hand, lack the genes for color entirely. Number nine, white cats are popular in media. White cats are no strangers to the spotlight, and with their beautiful striking coats, it's no surprise why. Duchess and Marie from the Aristocats are two of the most famous examples of white cats in media. These Turkish Angora cats made their first appearance over 50 years ago in 1970. Since then, they have appeared in several animated projects after the Aristocats, including the 2001 show House and the Mouse. Another famous white cat in the media is Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty is a white Japanese bobtail cat. She is one of the most iconic figures in media with television shows, movies, merchandise, and even two entire theme parks modeled after her. She is one of the most influential fictional white cats of all time. There are plenty of other famous white cats and they'll continue to serve as the inspiration for even more iconic characters in the future. Number 10, white cats are good luck. In many places around the world, white cats are symbols of good luck and good fortune. In some countries in the Mediterranean, it's believed that children that white cats are fond of will grow up to be successful and lucky. In Russia, white cats are thought to encourage the gain of money. If you have a white cat in your household, it's thought that you will be more financially successful. On the other hand, black cats are believed to bring bad luck and misfortune in some cultures. So, white cats are believed to have the opposite effect, since they are seen as the opposite of black cats. However, these superstitions have absolutely no truth to them. All cats, regardless of their coat color, make great friends and companions. I guess you can say that makes all cats lucky. Considering how beautiful and fascinating white cats are, it's not surprising that they are beloved companions around the world. If you found this video interesting, please give it a thumbs up because it helps other cat lovers find our content. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next Catterday for another video.